Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. Before we move on to any further details, I would really love to thank you all for your enormous love and support. In case you haven't subscribed yet, I mean, what are you waiting for, guys? Hit that subscribe button now. Also, please don't forget to press the bell icon. And also, if you enjoy the content and want to be a part of our inner circle, consider supporting us on Patreon. It's where we share exclusive behind-the-scenes content, early access, and connect with you on a more personal level. Please check the link in the description. Let's start the video now. According to a royal specialist, Prince Harry has been permanently in a state of paranoia since the publication of his explosive memoir. The Duke of Sussex is reportedly concerned that the royal family would retaliate. In a saga of royal turmoil, Prince Harry finds himself entrenched in a perpetual state of paranoia, haunted by fears of betrayal by the institution he once called his own. A renowned royal expert has shed light on Harry's profound apprehension, suggesting that he feels perpetually vulnerable to potential machinations orchestrated by what he refers to as the firm. The Duke of Sussex unleashed a scathing critique of his estranged kin in his explosive memoir titled Spare, unveiling to the world in January of the previous year. Within its pages, he levied serious accusations, alleging that his father's second wife, Camilla Parker Bowles, engaged in the insidious act of leaking confidential information to the press, ostensibly to bolster her own position within the royal hierarchy. In poignant reflections, Harry articulated his complex emotions regarding the addition of a step-parent to his life, lamenting a sense of betrayal as he believed himself sacrificed for the sake of personal publicity. In a funny way, I even wanted Camilla to be happy, Harry confessed, grappling with the tangled web of familial dynamics. The repercussions of Harry's revelations reverberate, casting a shadow over his interactions with the royal family. Speculation mounts as to the implications of his forthcoming encounter with his brother William, slated for a high-profile gathering later this summer. Renowned royal author Tom Quinn elucidated Harry's profound unease, postulating that his physical and emotional distance from the monarchy exacerbates his apprehension. He is permanently in the state of paranoia about the firm betraying him or doing things without letting him know, or planning things that will make him look bad, Quinn disclosed to the mirror. Amidst the tumult, Harry's accusations persist, with recent remarks implicating the royals in an unholy alliance with the British press, characterized by clandestine briefings and strategic leaks. In a candid exchange with ITV's Tom Bradby, Harry laid bare his grievances, accusing his family of fraternizing with malevolent forces. As the narrative unfolds, Harry's revelations continue to captivate public attention, providing a gripping spectacle in the realm of royal intrigue. With each revelation, the rift widens, exposing fractures within the hallowed halls of Buckingham Palace and beyond. So, what do you think about this news, guys? Write down in the comments what you think and let me know. Until then, guess we'll just have to wait and see if things turn out to be something after all. Also, if you never want to miss any of my sizzling royal updates like this, subscribe and press the bell icon. As simple as that. So, until the next time, hasta la vista!